So I have taken over as Arsenal manager and so far I have signed three world class players in Lois Appenda, Camavinga and Arnel Martinez and they have greatly improved the team so far with Appenda bagging Okay, it's decided not to show me how many goals uh, Pent has then. Apparently they've all got zero. Great news. Well, he has bagged a fair few goals for us. And now we are going to jump into our Champions League debut. There we go. Five goals in five games for Appenda. But here we go, our Champions League debut against PSV Eindhoven. Everyone in the team is fit. We'll go with our first team for this game. And here we go, a Pender kicks us off against PSV for our first ever Champions League game in charge of Arsenal. Which is good. Oh, Erdegaard finds the ball into a tender. He shoots. It's right past the keeper to the opposite side of the goal. Lois Appenda puts us one goal up ahead of PSV. Let's watch this goal back. Top left corner. Our first Champions League goal comes from a tender. Our star striker. What? Lang hasn't scored. How has he got one goal in one game? Oh my god, bro. I ha- I won it! running down Martinez nice tackle to put it out Ramsdale it took a hit off one of my players but luckily Ramsdale still had it covered Ramsdale Probably should have caught that one there. Bit annoyed he didn't catch it. Martinelli wins it. Erdegaard straight at Mauro. Gabriel luckily stopped it from going out for a corner. Martinelli to a pender. Martinelli's running. He's got the pace. He's done it, he finesses it, I wanted him to take it on his right, but he took it on the left and it was finessed past the goalkeeper to put us 2-1 up. Now, it's not a comfortable win so far, but our counter-attacking play, which is how I want to play, I have said that before, they can apply as much pressure as they want, as long as I can counter-attack freely. I'm happy. We just got it to Martinelli there who was able to run forward. He was being pressured but luckily a pender was in space. Oh my god bro! What is this? What is this? I know I said I don't mind him putting pressure on but not under now. Erdegaard. Saka out to Martinez, to Erdegaard, to Rice, Martinez back to Rice, couldn't find Cam Camavinga but Timber wins it back, Camavinga into Martinelli, 
Oh my god, Martinelli, what are you doing? He's carving forward, but what are you doing? Find the pass. Oh my god, bro, that was too close, man. They nearly got through at the end, but Jesus Christ, we should have won that game. And our next game, after our first Champions League game, is going to be a North London derby versus Tottenham Hotspurs. What's their team looking like? They brought in Veliz at striker. They don't have Vicario starting. They've put Foster in. Thanks, guys. We can get going now, yeah? Hopefully we can improve upon our last game against PSV. But our last game in the Prem was a pretty convincing win against United. And that's all we have time. So we are definitely looking for the win here. And a pender kicks us off. Erdegaard out to Saka. Don't lose it so easily this time. Even better save. Feliz takes a shot. Martinez is there to stop it. I don't even know who this Feliz guy is. It's some random striker they put in. Okay, my throwing. Saka. He's gone in for. Why did that not go where I wanted it to? That was completely off from Saka. It's fine. Worked it in. To Martinez, he swings it in. Hits the defender. Finds his way back to Erdogan. To Martinez, to Saka, who runs to Kamavinga, he shoots, Foster saves it. That's corner, right? Son is running forward here, Martinez needs to do a lot of work. Oh, he gets done. Oh my god, Gabriel! Why can nobody on my team pass? It feels like everything is going wrong because no one on my team except Erdegaard can actually pass. It is ridiculous. Zinchenko wins it back, goes to Martinelli. Kamvinga back to Martinelli. Who runs it forward. He finds it into a pender. Who shoots and it's a goal. A pender getting on the clean on the goal sheet once again. Another assist from Martinelli. On that left wing, Martinelli has been deadly this season. But it goes to Appenda once again. Oh my god, Ben White, you've literally been on the pitch for two minutes. Haven't touched the ball and you've given away a penalty. What was that? What was that penalty? Such a whack. Martinez to Saka. Go on Saka, how far can he go? Saka make up for it into Erdegaard who shoots. No! Oh my god, bro. Saka's coming off. Saka's coming off. Oh, I can't. Who holds it? Then he finds the pass to Martinelli. Martinelli into Erdegaard. Into Appender. Appender scores! Last minute equaliser versus Tottenham. What team play that was 
from Martinelli, Erdegaard and Appenda. The new trio has emerged in world football. Oh, well now we're just going to pass around the back. Why is the CPU program to do that? Why? Otherwise, Brentford will recall him. Sim match. Oh my god. How have we just lost 3 1 to Birmingham? Okay. That was a bit of a shock result, if I'm honest. I know I didn't care about it, but I didn't want to go out. I thought my team was good enough to be a championship side, at least. Okay, here we go, against Bournemouth. Smith Rowe wants to start. Let's start Ben White. There we go. I'm going to play highlights for this one. It's another one, this time into Saka. Saka finds the pass to a Penda who shoots. It's a goal. I don't know if that goes down as an own goal. It shouldn't because that was going in if the defender didn't get there. And an assist from Saka. Let's not forget that. Is this going to be the start of Saka's best form? Trust. I am really hoping so. He finds Martinelli. Martinelli finesses it, but it's an easy save for Neto. Smith Rowe on the counter. He's charging forward here. Who will I go for? He goes to Appenda. Appenda finds him. I tried to find Saka. He goes for it again. Saka. And it's another goal this time. Assist from Smith Rowe. Saka goal. This could be the start of some of Saka's best form. And we win pretty convincingly against Bournemouth. They had hardly any chances. It's a 10 match rating from Saka. 8.6 from Appenda. We had 67% possession, 16 shots, and they had zero. Okay, Martinez is looking a little tired, so let's try Timber at right back. Gonna put Tommy Asser and Kivior on the bench. There we go. This is going to be our game. Penda to Erdegaard. Saka makes a run. Finds a Penda. Oh my god, what a pass from Saka. Into a Penda who gets another goal. Can we watch that pass from Saka? Look at that, bro. It's a simple pass, but it is difficult, bro. Thomason finds their goal to equalise. Is this going to be just like the PSV game? I score, they equalise. There the guard finds Saka, who finds a pender after a deflection. He shoots and he scores to put us back up in the 40th minute 
should have been an assist from Saka, but uh, wait, does that count as an assist from Saka? Who knows? With a last ditch tackle to save him. Gabriel, what are you playing at? Every game we have conceded a penalty. I'm so bad, bro. How are we giving away this many penalties? It's not normal. You're kidding me, right? How was he just scored? He plays in Havertz. Havertz is running. Plays it back to Saka, who finesses it. It's a goal! What a goal from Saka! Last minute goal to equalise against RC Lens. Oh my god. What a goal from Saka. Can we watch that back, please? Havertz probably should have shot that he finds Saka. He nutmegs the defender and it's into the bottom corner. Me and Erdegaard have frozen in shock at how good that goal was. No, you're not scoring again. Oh my god, we should have won that game there. But it was a magnificent goal from Saka. Saka, one goal, one assist, 9.2 rating, a pender with a 10 match rating Jesus Christ mate that was an intense game there and our next game is against Manchester City but I will leave that for the next episode so I hope you all enjoyed and I will see you all in the next one. Good. Bye.